patients need to be concerned about the pandemic. The situation in Haiti remains uh, worrying because there is a lot of denial and fear uh, related to coronavirus. So even though uh, the increase in the number of cases is not as spectacular as what we could have feared, um, the uh, local transmission is still uh, very active. And what we uh, observe is that uh, many people are not coming forward to get tested or are afraid of, of going to the hospital due to um, rumours. Why is that? What kind of rumours are they hearing and how do you correct those rumours? Mm -hmm. So the main rumour is, is related to um, people are afraid that um, if they get injections, they, they fear that new vaccines for coronavirus may be tested on them and that these um, injections may be deadly or extremely dangerous. When we uh, engage with people in the community, one phrase, one sentence that we hear the most is, I would rather die at home than go to the hospital. So our teams in the field, in the communities are really, really struggling. And, and what they do is that they try to engage dialogue with people. They go door to door uh, to, to really try and, and have this dialogue and convince them uh, to change their mind. Actually, I was speaking to a patient uh, yesterday is a driver in Port-au-Prince. He was telling me that he waited for several weeks with fever at home before going to a hospital because of this rumor. And he was finally convinced by a friend uh, to go to hospital. And even when he was inside our hospital, he was still getting phone calls from friends and family members telling him, please do not accept um, injection. And we have family members of patients who are asking us not, not to inject anything to, uh, to patients, which is obviously making our work uh, difficult, um, but we, we try to cope and do our best. Has the